Hi guys, Anthony here. Welcome to the channel. Let's make those fitness goals happen. We're starting off here with single arm rows. My form is having the hand down on the bench with the knee on the same side right behind it. This gives me room to row on that working side. And of course, when you want to train the other side, it's the exact same thing. This focuses on the lat muscle, so the sides of your back. But believe it or not, it actually works the core. Whatever weight you're rowing, it's trying to twist your body so your abs is holding you together. Remember, your abs works that balance in your body. And of course, the bicep and other back muscles are still worked. I recommend about eight to 15 reps each side and doing three to five sets. When rowing, try to keep that elbow in as close as possible as you can. It's not easy for a reason, so don't beat yourself up about it. Move on. Single arm preacher curls. It's my first time doing these at the gym. In a public gym, it's different because they have a preacher curl bench, but I don't have one, so I put my workout bench in incline and it worked great. I honestly haven't done these in a while. Forgive my shakiness and mistakes in my tempo. Make sure your arm is straight and curl to your shoulder. The bicep muscle will get tired. It'll be more of a challenge in the curl to bring your arm all the way down than usual. I recommend about eight to 12 reps for four sets and do a weight you can handle. You wanna work the muscle, not the ego. We've got this guys, rear delt cable fly. So the focus is on that upper back. Remember this improves posture. Grab the handle on the right with your left hand and the handle on the left with your right hand. Now you made an X. Put your arms in front of your chest level and pull back to your sides. I go really light. Reps 12 to 15, three to four sets. Okay, this super was actually really hard, especially after all those exercises we just did together. I'm curling those 20s and you can see my biceps are being worked, but that's nothing for how tired you guys are going to see me get. Do as many bicep curls as you can here. Then right away, go to curl on the cable machine. I use a straight bar, but you can use a curved one as well. My biceps were on fire. I could only do the superset twice. I was so sore. When I was curling on the cable, it felt like I was curling 100 pounds because my biceps were just so exhausted. I gave this everything I had. I only did two supersets after all that, but I challenge you guys to beat me. Can you do more than two supersets after all those exercises? If you can, let me know in the comments. So for this one, I recommend that we do one to three supersets after all those exercises. Reps is up to you, but you guys noticed I went for about 12. Remember to not sacrifice form. I was giving it my absolute best, but I didn't have any bad form. Safety and proper technique technique is number one. You know what I learned about fitness? There's no specific way to do everything. For some things, yeah, sure. But for a majority of the workouts, I've learned that as long as you actually care and give some effort, you'll see those fitness goals happen. You'll make that progress. You don't have to be perfect. Just do the best you can. Show up, get better every time by just a little bit. It's funny because when I was doing this second superset, I was like, should I even be doing this? Maybe I should have just stopped after the first one. But hey, I pushed myself. Self-motivation is key. Have those positive thoughts. There's negativity everywhere. Tell yourself you can do it for once. Be your own workout partner. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe, share my videos, like, and comment. Have a great day.